Hello Cancer, thank you so much for coming to Echo Catcher Tarot. This is going to be a reading for January 26th to January 31st, 2021. Please remember there's no way this can connect to everybody. So the full moon is going to be on the 28th, which is going to be the wolf moon or sometimes called the ice moon. So be aware that may affect you. And we change on the 20th to Aquarius sign. So the oracle cards over here are all for you. The tarot cards are over here, which will be the energies around you, but you'll more than likely show up over there as well. So I read the cards. You decide if they apply to your situation. Feel free to vice versa, masculine, feminine. And thank you for all the support on the channel. I appreciate it so very much. The first one of the Soul's Journey lesson cards is adversity. I accept that challenges are the best way to learn. So this says you've been through a difficult time lately, Cancer, and the universe is hoping you learn from whatever challenge you have been going through. It's meant for you to learn something important. Envy. I am the same as everybody, but with different challenges. So I do feel like the adversity um, is pushing you to change, and either people are going to be envious of you because you're changing or what you went through, and you have to be aware of that. Pay attention to people who are envious of you. They don't know your life. They're just looking from the outside in and judging you. So be aware of that energy around you. The next one is imagination. I embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind. So you have a lot of imagination on where you want your life to go, I feel, or maybe how you want your life to change. The adversity, I feel like, has changed you in some way. And some people don't like the way you've changed, but your imagination seems to be pushing you in a new direction, maybe around new people possibly as well, a new life, and you can expect somebody doesn't want that. So now I'm switching to the Mystical Cats Tarot deck. Eight of C. So somebody around you is very selfish. They only think about themselves and they do not want you to change or move out of their vibration, their life. They don't want you to quit doing something you're doing for them. Nine of Earth. You see the bigger picture in your life. You see a different future than what somebody else sees for you. You see a different choice. So Sky Queen is somebody who watches you and they don't say anything. So there's somebody watching your social media. I feel like they could possibly talk a lot, gossip, talk to other people, but they don't talk to you. So the cat. The cat is taking a leap of faith. This is my precursor to going towards a new beginning of something that is going to be beautiful for you. So two of C, you're going towards a new love. That's what that says and that's usually what that card means. But I gave it a broader spectrum. So new love is coming towards you, Cancer. So Ace of Sky is a warning that there's going to be people around you who are jealous. People are going to try and stop this. There's people not for your highest good when you move forward and find new love that are going to cause problems. So for a fire, it could be a marriage situation. So I don't know if you're moving into a marriage situation or leaving one. And the marriage situation is going to cause problems in the new love. Six of Sky, you're moving away from chaos and drama. There's chaotic and dramatic people around you and you're moving away from that. It could be somebody you are married to. So true love again, wow, and it's going over the other true love card. So there's true love somewhere involved in this. And you have envy up there. Somebody's jealous, you have love. So this is Eight of Earth. This is somebody blaming somebody for something they didn't do. So I do feel like the envious people are talking about you. They're trying to create drama for you. And they're spreading lies. They're blaming you for something that you should not be blamed for. So Cat Magic talks about you have manifested or you're in the process of changing your life to happier to what you want your life to be like. You are changing it. You alone. So Two of Sky says that you have waited a long time to change this and make this decision, but you've known for quite a while that you wanted to move out of the situation, so to speak, and you are finally going to do it. So look at the next card is the Capricorn energy, which is toxic energy. It's going over the love. So it matches the envy and the adversity. Somebody is giving you a very difficult time. 
I feel like you need to use your imagination on how these people can go against you and cause problems because I feel like they're going to do it. So let me pull the Tarot Illuminati cards for you now. You, somebody loves you or you love somebody. Three strong love cards in this reading. So judgment. So somebody's going to have judgment. They're going to realize that somebody is toxic to them. And they're going to... I feel like it's you. You're going to say, this is done. I'm not going to deal with this behavior anymore. I'm not going to accept this. I'm calling judgment on you. Leave me alone. So the sun, you're going towards your happiness. This could be you, Cancer... Or Leo placement, but you're moving towards happiness. Princess of Pentacles. So Princess of Pentacles is somebody who can communicate very well. The princess can communicate how strong she is, that she doesn't need another person to defend her. She's very good at debates. She sees the future. She's very good at bringing coins and making herself stable. But most of all, she's very good at holding her own to go towards her happiness and not let other people interfere. So Ace of Cups again. Wow, there's a lot of true love around you, Cancer. This is true love. This could be somebody crying for you that is not in your life anymore. The Hermit. So the Hermit talks about, to me, it could be you withdrawing from other people and going by yourself to find answers. Or it could be that you're just getting clarity. Clarity coming very fast. Things are very clear to you. When you pass the judgment on this person and tell them what's going on, how it's going to be, you could just be done with them. A hermit means you could pull away from them and that's it. So King of Wands is somebody who is an action king. He does what he says he's going to do. He has integrity. He can speak with um, abruptness. He can make plans and follow through with those plans. He can exhibit strength, organization, communicate communicate clearly. So five of wands. This is going to cause conflict with other people. Other people are going to try and cause conflict. They're not liking the direction you're going, whether you're leaving them. They are very angry about it and going to try and cause problems for you. So now I'm going to pull the Oracle of E cards for you. So, wow, very good. True love is coming at you. It looks like it's coming fast, Cancer. So the first one is baggage be gone, 17, which would equal 8. So something is coming full circle that you're leaving behind, and you realize, matter-of-factly, it was not for your best interest. So knock, knock, change. Change is knocking on your door. Change is coming, and it's going to change, and you're not going to look back on this negativity, these negative people whatever was hurting you or caused hardship, you're leaving it behind. So now I'm moving to the Whispers of the Ocean. You have Back on Tasks 39. Be sure you're using your time in the best possible manner. You might be considering reviewing your goals, your schedule, or a project you're working on. All could use some fine-tuning. So I feel like you need to pay attention to your life and what you have going on to protect it from these negative energies and the envy. Whatever you can do, I'm feeling like you should put passwords on your, um, what's it called, your... Gosh, like your um, contracts. You should put password on your contracts, your computer, your phone, something like that. I feel like somebody's working at night time to cause problems to you. I feel like this is telling you be aware. Be one step ahead of those people. You can do it. The next one is 10 every step counts. So no matter how slow you're using, this is a new to branch gill. However, slow you're moving, you're, you're really moving towards your future no matter how slow you feel like you are. And this is beauty. This is beauty and it's really little and most people don't see it. So people don't see your beauty in you is what I feel. And there is an advantage to taking things slowly, breathe deeply and fully as you connect to your options. So I do feel like you're kind of going with the flow right now, which is what the new to branch Gil does. It's like a sea slug that's really beautiful. So I feel like you're moving slower. You feel like it's slower, but the universe says you're doing what you're supposed to be doing. Don't feel like you're going too slow. You're moving. 
That's all that counts. And you're making right decisions for yourself is what I feel. And other people don't like that. All right, so the next one, Whispers of the Ocean, is Elder. Move beyond ancestral patterns. So there's something how you were raised or taught to do, and you're changing that. You're like, that's not working for me. I'm different. I'm going to live my life how I want. You're going to do what's good for you. So adversity is hardships have changed you to where you are going to change something about you and the way your life is. Heart guardian, love and let yourself be loved. Wow. So, Cancer, you are moving into a vibration of love where you need to let people love you and you feel free to love the people who you let love you. They're for your highest good. I feel like Elder is wise. Wise information being downloaded to you that whatever this pain or hurt or adversity was back here in the envy is changing you. It's making you love yourself more. It's making you move away from people who aren't for your highest good. And that is good. So thank you so much, Cancer, for coming to Echo Catcher Tarot. Bless you, Cancer.